Hello, the good people of Biafra and Africa in general. A caged lion never helps itself. And that is why a caged lion cannot act. And a lion is being put in a cage in the zoo so that people can come close to it and people can feed it because he is, it is helpless. This very video is going to those that are supposed to be the mouthpiece of Mazin Namdukukano in the predicament that he faces today. Unfortunately, those that are supposed to rise and take the necessary actions has failed him. But the Chukwo Kikobe Maprumi Henine of Biafra will never fail him. Watch this video to the end. Help me share this video to get to Mazi Chika Edoziem. And let him tell me if he has done well. But it's going to be a thing of shame if in his own watch anything bad happened to Madin Namduku Khan. The land of Biafra will not forgive him. Because he had every option to do the right thing. He either does not want to do it or he's being deceived because he allowed himself to be deceived. He was busy chasing rats while the sun, the house is on fire. Welcome to M Special. This is M Special. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. Big thanks for watching our video. Much, much big thanks to those that recently subscribed to our channel. May Chukoki Gobi Maprumi Henine of Biafra bless you and bless your hand good good hand work together we must do the needful to get the nation called biafra restored most especially to get our leader our lovely leader mazen nam dukukano out of the dungeon of the da the dss of the zoo called nigeria alive I had a disturbing video and I want everybody that will see this video, please do let this video get to Mazi Chika Edozim. I know he has seen this video, but I want him to see what I'm telling him through this audio, uh, this video. So, as I said, M Special Deliberate on News. I am a Brafran agitator under Mazi Namdu I deliberate on daily news that we all sees and watches and you the viewers will bring the final say through the comment section together for those that are genuinely on the struggle of Biafra restoration we shall see the Biafra restored and those that are in the struggle of Biafra res restoration to enrich themselves the land of the earth where they are standing in any country they are residing will not protect them because of the blood of those that have departed on the course of this struggle. What the video I want to put on now is so heartbreaking. I saw it just some hours ago and I'm moved to say something about it, especially to Mazi Chika Edozim. First of all, let's give you full details of the press release by Barrister Aloy Ejimako. The operative of the Department of State Services has confined the leader of the indigenous people of the Afro Ibo, Namdi Kanu, to solitary confinement without seeing sunlight from 23 hours a day. Sarah reporter had gathered. The nation's secret police have also allegedly not allowed the pro Biafra agitator to change his clothes since he was renditioned in June and any detainee that exchanges pleasantly with him is condemned to a solitary cell or maximum security punishment. Mm. All these inhuman treatment and orders are meted out as punishment on Kanu according to the press release received from his lawyers. The statement was signed by 
two of Kanu's leading lawyers, a lawyer Jimako and Ifanyi Ijofo, and made available on Thursday. In a statement titled, Mazinam the Kanu's detention condition at DSS amount to torture. His lawyers also alleged that the DSS official did not allow him to have a new pair of glasses since they broke into pieces the one he was using during his abduction in Kenya. The statement read thus, Our client Mazinam Dikanu has instructed us to make the following information public, that despite a court order to the contrary, the condition of his detention at the DSS headquarters in Abuja continues to be harsh, degrading, and inhuman, that he is solitarily confined to a very tiny cell 23 hours of the day without access to sunlight and any social interaction whatsoever. He believes that this is aimed at inflicting extreme emotional and mental distress on him and breaking him psychologically. That any detainee who encounters and greets him during the single hour he is allowed outside his cell is promptly put in solitary confinement or transferred to maximum security as a punishment for exchanging mere greetings with him. Because of these, detainees have resorted to avoid avoiding him and exchanging ple pleasantries with him, not to talk of any other form of social interaction. That since the Nigerian government extraordinarily renditioned him, he has not been allowed a change of clothing and his Jewish prayer Shaw and other religious material brought to him by his counsel were rejected and returned. That the DSS has refused to replace his corrective glasses lenses, which were smashed to pieces by agents of the Nigerian government in the process of violating the unleash on him while abducting him in Kenya. This has led to a rapid deterioration of his sight that he is restricted to meeting with his counsel in an atmosphere devoid of private discussion with his counsel, and he is oftentimes the naive per user of legal documentation his counsel brings to him to review, that he is not allowed to sleep with a pillow, and this has led to him developing acid reflux, which comes with acute burning sensation, in his chest, chest pains, and extreme difficulty in swallowing. That on the 17th July 2021, one of his lawyers, the undersigned barrister Aloy Jimako, was detained and interrogated for hours by the DSS when he came to the DSS on visitation to Mazinam de Kanu, who witnessed the detention before being led away, was very distressed and alarmed by this incident, and he considered it a brazen act of intimidation of his counsel that he has to date been denied access to the british consul this so my dear people you have heard what happened but let me quickly say it, with all due respect to lawyer our barrister ejimako ejimafo ejiafo on what he has been telling us that he is hardy and hardy healthy and hearty until we saw him the very first appearance are you now telling me that all this we are hearing from this very video is just happening after the last drama are you telling me that all this happened between 10th of november to this moment when we tell you people that they had a script that they are following you nobody wants to agree with us it is a very thing of shame, the last court, that a team of lawyers, we are all out, all outside, and their clients were left alone. That can never happen anywhere, not even in a peaceful, uh, normal court arena, that that will happen. A lawyer must follow up the person that is being going to be interrogated, the person in question, a lawyer, it's always two lawyers, and one will engage with, with, the, with the judiciary, and during the interrogation, one will follow and stand by and hear 
how that person is responding to the interrogation after they have interrogated the person to know that what that person is saying is what they spoke online with that person to say. I know you will say Nigeria is not like that, but how can a team of five lawyers, including a Jacob that knows it best, be outside? And now he is just telling us, he was just doing what they told him to do. If you like, you believe it. If you don't like, don't believe it. I keep asking what question. Ejiako has been hunting for killing. And immediately he started telling us, Mazin Namduku can say this, Mazin Namduku can say that. All of a sudden, the fear of killing him disappeared. Is that not telling you something as a Biafran? Does that not tell you that those that want to kill lawyer Ejiako are those that kidnapped Mazin Namduku Kano? Is that not telling you that those that kidnap Mazin Namduku Kano are those that are in the family that helped to sell, sell him out to the enemy? And you are there shouting command and control. Those that cancel the seat at home order are those that have their signatory to the predicament of Mazin Namduku Kano. You don't need anybody to prophesy on that for you. If you are an adult, you must see with your foresight. You must articulate with your wisdom. And you can see what an ordinary eyes cannot see. Have you not seen how the brother... Some people said you are calling the family the brother. Yes, you see the truth, you say it. You cannot see the truth and like some of my fellow Biafran media warriors... Just because Mazin Namdu Kukano was the person that sent, set up DOS does not mean that DOS is as perfect as Mazin Namdu Kukano. It is people that makes the institution to be legitimate or to be what it's supposed to be. It's not about the name. It's not the building. And when you see that the people that are supposed to make the institution to be what it's supposed to be and the reason to stand for the reason that that institution was set up you're supposed to speak out it is your responsibility to shout it out so that you will help them to correct their ills in case they do not know but in this very case it shows me that there are lots of short-sighted short followers in IPOB that are only there to make a noise and not to articulate. Send this video to Mazi Chika Edozim. Mazi Chika Edozim, as I always call you, because that you are in this position to do something, but you have failed the Biafrans. You have failed Mazi Namdi Kukano. You have failed us, but there is always chance for you to wake up again if you can. I keep saying it, I think you were on, on the defense. You never thought that this day would come, like you said. That was why in the beginning, you were the most shocked person when you, the news broke out. And now, you have to manage the struggle with those that you don't even know what they stand for in this very time and this struggle. And you have no option than to protect them even in their mess. But the earlier you see, you show them the roads to go out and bring in the people that will tell you the truth and help you to get this right done before it is too late, the better for the struggle of Biafra. Thank you and tell me what you think. Do not forget to subscribe to our videos. Do not forget to give us that like, thumbs up if you like this video. Do pray for Mazin Namdu Kukano. His life is very important to us. He does not deserve to die. He's supposed to be with us. Think about his wife and his children. They are all seeing what is going on. Do not forget that those children will grow. And God forbid that they will stand to ask I and you. Especially those that call themselves the DOS that has no business than to chase shadows. They will ask you what you did then. What are you going to answer them? What will be your reply to them? What response are you going to give to them? 
do you actually have feelings? If you people do have feelings, you will not give Radio Biafra to those that doesn't know what this time is all about. Than coming to Radio Biafra to shatter and insult and call names to people that genuinely want to see Mazin Namdi Kano out of the dungeon. Thank you and together we shall build the Biafra of our dream if we agree. <laughs>